seguimos, eh, vamos a hacer las misiones un poco legales. What can I get you, stranger? The irregulars thank you. Yeah. Make us blessings upon you, Warden. Las misiones de los cadáveres son, son grandiosas. Son asesinos, han matado y, y no saben qué hacer con los cuerpos. Entonces los cogeremos nosotros y los tiraremos a un pozo. Es <ríe> muy bizarro. Aquí hay uno. I won't take the blame for this one. This was bad from the start. No way he was. I won't take the blame for this one. Thanks. I ain't sticking around. ¿Qué lleva ahí? Es una alfombra. <ríe> es una alfombra persa que traigo para, para el señor. Huele un poco a mentira, pero bueno. They've got to learn not to mess with me. Strange that matters can be so tumultuous and yet the day still be so bright. Oh, my pardon, just thinking aloud. Are you here for the Chanter's board? I am Sister Justine, curator of the reliquary of this Chantry. <laughs> Pride again. It is hard to live up to the example of Andraste. The archivist tends the books, and I tend the sacred relics. I also search for more to add to our collection, which is more difficult than it sounds.
my thought exactly, but I'm perpetually amazed at how quickly people accept fantastic claims at face value. A hawker on the street will claim to have an actual finger bone of Andraste. In this city alone, you could make the skeleton of ten prophets from fingers alone. Curators often accept them as genuine. I worry about the authenticity of even our most holy artifacts. When I was a curator of a much smaller chantry in Orlay, I thought that false relics slipped through because of laziness. But the life of the cloth is never an easy one, and that explanation always seemed hollow to me. Now I believe it's the seduction of the divine. We all want a personal connection to the Maker. We want to believe that what we hold in our hands is the actual sandal that slipped from Andraste's foot before the fires consumed her. Faith is of the heart, not of the head. When the heart is ungoverned by reason, charlatans have powerful tools to deceive. And often close to heretical. But I believe that the truth only increases the awe of the Maker and his prophet, not demean it. Even false symbols have the power to inspire. But it seems every year we fall more out of touch with the real Andraste. Certainly, my research indicates that all of the ashes were gathered into a pot or urn, but it's been lost for centuries. That doesn't stop hawkers from selling pinches of the ashes of Andraste to gullible pilgrims. The real ashes may still be hidden somewhere, though it's possible the urn broke. Of course, enjoy your visit to the Chantry. Never move all men are the work of the one who repents, who has faith unshaken by the darkness of the world, and roasts not, nor gloats over the misfortunes of the weak, but takes delight in the Maker's law and creations. Boasts. It's boasts, sister, not roasts. She <laughs> shall know the peas of the Maker's benediction. The light shall lead her safely through the paths of this world and into the next. Peace, sister, peace. She shall know the peace of the Maker's benediction. The veal holds no uncertainty for her. And she will know no fear of death. For the Maker shall be her bacon and her shield, her foundation and her... There's no veal in the chant. You're doing this on purpose, aren't you? Um, uh, blessings of the Maker and of Andraste, his bride, upon you. <laughs> yes. I'm sorry, but your husband has fallen in battle. You have my condolences. What? This is terrible! Oh, my love! My beloved! Dwarven crab. Welcome. Welcome. We sell only the strongest dwarven steel, folded over a hundred times in the forges of Orzammar. In times like this, surely your group could use some extra protection on the road. Every piece comes with a stamp of assurance from my wife's father, the best smith in Denerim. Vale, pues aquí está la misión para la, la ceniza de los gastos. El hermano este no es el, el que se supone que es. 
Cuando queramos entrar por la puerta del fondo nos dirá, no podéis pasar, no sé qué. Y cuando pasemos, pues nos atacará. Yes. What are you doing here? Brother Genitivi. Why? He was on the trail of the urn of sacred ashes, yes. Whether he found it, the maker only knows. I haven't seen Brother Genitivi in weeks. He sent no word. It's so unlike. I'm afraid something has happened. Genitivi's research into the urn may have led him into danger. Perhaps the urn has been lost for a reason. I pray for Genitivi's safety, but hope dwindles with each passing day. I, I tried to send help, but some knights came from Redcliffe looking for him not long ago. I sent them after Genitivi, and they too have disappeared. Well, they haven't returned, and they sent no word either. I, I, I don't know. After what happened to Genitivi, can you blame me for thinking the same thing could happen to the knights? Perhaps I am just a pessimist. I hope I am wrong. Now, don't ask me where they went. You'll go after them. And what if ill luck should befall you too? This search is a curse on all of us. Some things are, are not meant to be found. I know that now. So be it. All he said before he left was that he would be staying at an inn near Lake Callenhard, investigating something in that area. If you were wise, you would turn away and never look back. Please, I beg you. I do not think this will end well. All actions have consequences. Perhaps Genitivi brought this on himself. Genitivi could not see how the search had consumed him. It was all he thought about. I hated seeing him like that. I'm not surprised it led to this. It is just the fear speaking. You're wasting time. If you insist on going after Brother Genitivi, you should leave as soon as possible. I mean, well, you seemed so <laughs> earnest. If anyone is to find him, they should do it sooner rather than later. I, I am just his assistant. I, I just follow instructions. Yes, yes, of course. Thank you for your concern. I, it's been a very difficult time for me and sometimes I don't know what to think or feel. I want Genitivi to be rescued, but I don't want more people to be hurt. You understand, don't you? You do not have to trust me. My conscience is clear. Follow in Genitivi's footsteps if you must, but be careful. What are you doing? You're not supposed to go in there. I'm sorry, but that room is not for guests. It's full of books and papers, and I'd rather they were not disturbed. I said no. Ginny TV was a very private person. No, don't touch that door! Something is coming.